For this month, we're going to look at a Scottish tune slash song called Mary's Wedding. We're not going to do the words today, just the melody. Um, and I want to use it because it's a good way to introduce uh, what should be an upstroke and what should be a downstroke. Um, so first of all, we're going to learn the melody all on the beat. Now with the mandolin, um, the rule is, is that if it's on the beat, it's a downstroke. And if it's off the beat, it's an upstroke. So if you've got four beats in a bar, um, every beat has an and. So one and two and three and four and. So all of your one, two, three, four should be down and all of your ands up. So it's like this one and two and three and four and. So in this first version of Mary's Wedding, every note is on the beat. It all falls on the beat. So there are no upstrokes in this piece of music. It's down, 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 down. Everything falls on the beat. Um, so we're going to play it. I've got the, I'm going to have the metronome in my ear, so you don't need to worry about time. If you want the tab, head over to mandomike.com where um, you can download the PDF to go with it, or you can just play along by ear. That's totally fine. But the most important thing with this first time we play it is that it's all down. One, two, three, four. Okay, so let's now introduce a couple of upstrokes and where we're going to do that is the first and fifth bar of the A part and then the first and fifth bar of the B part. So if we look at the, let's just take bar one. Um, in that previous version, we just got, went like this. If we make the first and third notes slightly longer and the second and fourth notes half the amount of time, so beat one is now last for a beat and a half. It means beat two comes in off the beat. So instead of, it sounds like this. Kind of the first note's longer. So the whole bar now becomes this. That was bar two again. I'll do that again. Down, up, down, up, down, down, down. So now those two notes, uh, notes, the second note and the fourth note are now off the beat, so down, up, down, up, down. The same applies in bar five. Down, up, down, up, down, down. And then if we look at bar, the first bar of the B part, instead of going, we're gonna make the second note of that bar this D or fifth fret, we're going to make it worth one and a half beats, and then the very last note of the bar, the open E, we're going to make that half a beat. So instead of... It sounds like this. I'll do that again. Okay, so there's now six upstrokes uh, in this piece of music. So let's play it again, same speed. I'll still have the metronome in my ear. Um, and after four. One, two, three, four. 
Thanks for watching, I hope you've learned something, get in touch via mandomike.com if you have any questions uh, and I'll see you next month.